My player gave your brother work and watch him hustle nickels You had a mom who smoked culture, shit I understood you But all these games you bitches playing, I ain't playing with you Word got back to me, you doing bad, you doing bad huh? And word got back to me, you bitches mad, you bitches mad huh? And word got back to me that that nigga Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. If you're new to my channel, what's up? If you're not new to my channel, what's up? If you're mad, it was up. And if you're bad, it was up. And we is back with another video. All right, so if you see me looking same, that's because I'm trying to kill two birds in one stone. We're gonna get two videos done. They're not gonna be uploaded at the same time. But we're gonna get two videos done. Yeah. If I would have actually swooped my baby hair, son, this would have been a little cool. But all right, so and it's a video. Depending on what this title is, I don't know yet, but we're finna be talking about feminine products when it's that time of the month when you on your uh, menstrual, your monthly, whatever I'm about to give. Well, I'm about to tell y'all what I, I'm sorry that I do this a lot, I'm sorry, I just left my notes up. <laughs> but um, I'm gonna tell y'all what I like to use. Yeah, what I like to use during that time of month. So yeah, let's get to the video all right so yeah basically so you know that girl what <laughs> let's try this again all right so you know during that time of the month you feel me you gotta keep it fresh because if you don't keep it fresh <laughs> If you don't keep it fresh, you gonna be smelling funky and niggas gonna know that you on your period. And nobody needs to know when you on your period. Nobody needs to be smelling you smelling like, as niggas say, pennies, okay? <laughs> they don't want, we don't want to smell it. So, basically, so when I was younger, when I first like came on my period, I started with pads. The regular brand i forgot the brand name but it's like in a blue packaging if i could find a picture i'm gonna try to put it up here but it's like with the blue packaging and i used the orange one and the orange wrapper and i when i was wearing pads i like the no wings i did not like the fucking wings because they always get fucking stuck on the joint and you feel me that would get annoying but as i got older like back then i never just like sitting in the blood because i have a very 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 heavy flow and sadly my menstrual cycle lasts for seven motherfucking days so it wasn't heavy the whole seven days but it just be so heavy like the first two to three days i'm talking about bitch it's just not nice. Stop and I just did not like sitting in that day you like in school you had to I would put on so much I would put on like I had like everybody every girl got their little period panties so I had my period panties on with the pad in there and then I would have spandex on like little spandex underwear and then I would have like the little uh they like like the biker shirts materials on top of that and then have on like my regular pants or my school uniform pants and stuff like nobody don't be trying to be having the time to be trying to do all that trying to put all that on and you ask your friend like can you see my bag can you see my pad on my pants can you see my bag they used to get annoying like i used to wear like the long sweaters that would cover your butt so i wouldn't have to worry about if you could see my motherfucking pad or if you could see my fucking pad like don't i want to see how you trying to be all cute on your you you fucking go yard bag and bitch you can see your path from the back like <laughs> no baby no so yeah as i got older you know i'm just like you know what let me try because i used to be scared to like try tampons because i just used to be scared like i'm not trying to stick up shit in my coochie and then when i was doing like you know, the research, it was like TSS and that's toxic. Ooh, that's hard to say. Toxic shock syndrome. And I was scared to get that because I'm just like, I don't want to get that. Like, I don't want to get that. I don't want to die. <sighs> but yeah, so I was like, let me try. And I was like, I don't want to be sticking no harsh chemicals up in there because the brands that's out here these days, they made with harsh chemicals. And I didn't want to stick that up there. I'm like, it was bad enough. I had to have my coochie sitting on it. I don't want to stick that shit up. My cool kid. So I did my research and I came across. I don't have the box, but I still have the tampons. So first brand I came across was Cora. 
I love these, y'all. Like, I found these on Amazon. So, it's called Cora. I'm going to show y'all what it looks like. Let me show y'all. Okay. Nails long. So, this is what they look like. Cora Organic. So, they are organic, y'all. No dyes. No, I guess it's parabens. I don't know. None of them extra dyes and chemicals in these. It's cotton. It's organic. I fucking love these. And... They not even that expensive. They might be like $13, $15, but you get a good amount in there. Like one full box. Cause I would get a box mixed because you know you have to, when you're using tampons, you have to put the size for your flow. Don't be trying to put no big ass, thick ass tampon in your cootie cat. I'm sorry, excuse me. Somebody's notification but i'm trying to stick on a big ass heavy super size tampon you cootie cat and your flow is like like no that's not even it so i will order the box that will come with like the super and the regular and then i ended up ordering a box that comes with the regular and what size is this the regular and the light so in the box it comes in a nice little small box and they all be in there. i don't remember how many come in there i want to say maybe like 28 or something maybe 30 but the box will last me like almost two cycles. Like it will last me my first cycle and then I will still have a couple for like my next cycle. But I will usually mostly use, I want to say the regular because like I said, my flow is only heavy for like first two to three days. So I will stay using super and once it starts to get lighter, I will use the regular. And then if it's something it's like really, really light, it might be like spotting. I will use the regular or I will use a pad. So I do still use pads, but I only use pads at night when I'm going to sleep. Or if like my flow is so, so light to the fact, I'm like, I'm not gonna stick no tampon up in here because it's really just, spot and like really really like spot and i'm just like i don't want to mess up my cute patties either or even like i just don't want to just in case because sometimes i notice because i have like a irregularly irregularly regular period so sometimes like if i have a tampon i wear my tampon then it might stop my flow for like a day and then i have to wear a pad the whole day to let it just fucking come out and then the next day for me you feel me so yes i fucking love these y'all i really like when i tell y'all i love these i love cobra brand like i love this brand i love this brand i love this brand so then the pads i use is these they're by l they are the chlorine free ultra thin pads when i tell the fuck y'all now these i found these in target both of these brands, Cora and L, they both have their own tampons and pads. But I love these. They so thin, y'all. They so thin, but they hold so good. Like, they really, really thin at first. I'm just like, hold up now, because my flow real heavy. I don't know if this is going to do to do. But that shit keep, girl, it do to do. So, if you got real heavy flow, because them other pads, they just too thick. Like, they is too thick. I, I can't. It's too thick. This is, like, so thin they so thin i'm gonna unwrap one of these of each even though i don't want to but i am they so thin i don't have now i did buy so i also have these pads by l and i'm gonna get in i mean these pads, I said these, pads. these tampons by l i have some of my core ones in here but i have the regular and the super by this brand and i'm gonna get into which brand i like better but i have these and then i also did order pads by Cora as well but yeah so okay so i recently tried the l tampons i recently tried these um it comes with i don't know how many come in here but so this is a super i'm gonna just open both regulars for each brand because bitch i need these hoes where's the other little little joint i was going to use hold up i need these little bitches for when i need so when i first ordered the cover brand i ordered i didn't know what the difference between a applicator tampon and a non-applicator tampon so 
when I used to see on the commercials with the tampons and when I opened a box and I had a whole bunch of these and like super and regular, I was looking like, what the fuck is this? And how is this little ass thing supposed to, you feel me? So yeah, with these ones, you had to like stick it up there yourself with your fingers. And with these, these come with, um, what's it called? These come with the applicator. I think I'm gonna open a light one instead of a regular yeah these come with the applicator and so do these but yeah i was so confused on how to use this ever but i love these now out of the two brands out of cora so we're gonna start with the tampons out of cora and l i do not like these i do not like these y'all i just my last period is when i bought these i put in a super y'all i put in a super john and when it was time for me to change it, that shit hurt so bad. It hurt so bad to pull the shit out. Of it was hurting so bad. And I'm just like, like in that joint, like, what's going on? Like, I'm just trying to pull it out. Y'all, it hurt so bad. It was like so dry. And it just hurt. Like, I never felt no pain. Y'all never felt no pain. So, you know, your little coochie muscles. I'm still trying to squeeze that joint. Like, squeeze it to help push that joint out y'all i'm pulling on the string it's not coming out y'all so the reason i think is because i think with this brand l is like i guess there are sizes because it come with like little instructions in here about like the time change and the flow you feel me i think with this brand they're like up from this brand it's like their regular is a super and their super is like a super super or some shit because i was fucking confused i never had that problem when i used this brand but i'm gonna show you the difference this brand is also like so this is what a tampon if you don't know what a tampon like looks like when you open it i don't mind wasting this brand because i really don't like it of course i'm gonna use them because i got it and bitch i'm not gonna waste my money but you feel what i'm saying so I wish I had like a clear glass or something so I could actually show y'all what the fuck a, the tampon look like. I'm going to take this shot glass that I need to clean out. This was like two years ago. I'm going to pour some water in here so I could show y'all. Oh, damn, shorty. All right, boom. So we got that. Let me close this. But okay, so with this brand where of uh, this brand i noticed it's like a rectangle shape and with this brand it's like a circle shape so mind you these are two different sizes this is regular this is light this is from l this is from cora and i'm gonna open so y'all can see all right so boom these are the two tampons from each brand you feel me this is what they look like the only thing i do notice with either or tampons this brand i i believe is a little bit harder regardless but when you have nails on it is so hard to fucking cl close the bottom of this but this tampon is like oval i mean rectangularly shaped when it's unfold there when it's soaked up in the blood it's like so weird y'all it's so weird i really do not like this brand like, it was so it was just no and even when i put the regular in it was fine but i noticed i had to leave them in like a little bit longer than the time i usually change because it was just fucking hurt and eventually i got used to like the time and shit like that so basically when you get the tampon this is what you do you make sure you wash your hands of course you pull this and you could you could see it coming down so just make sure you pay attention you're not gonna be able to see it on camera but you just pull it down because when i first got a tampon you i did not know how to put the shit in i kept just like sticking it up there and then pulling this out and it the whole thing would come out like i was so confused i did not know how to use this shit so this is what you do i need to set this up so y'all can really see hold up let me try Back y'all up real quick. Y'all can really see. All right, boom. So, you take the tampon and we pull the joint. Now, don't pull it all the way. I'll just pull it out a little bit. 
and then you you this is gonna be a coochie you gonna stick that shit up there till you get to to this part gets to like it's touching your skin and then you just gonna push bad boy like i said sometimes you just gonna push it out y'all see it expanding you just gonna push 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 all the way till you get to this moment right here this is the hard part when you got long nails but you want to push so now this is flat now that this flat what happened yeah now that this flat it just slide right out and then you got the joint you got the joint okay but all right so let me slide y'all back up in the position shape all right so with this shape now it's all wet you see this shit all like wide it's like out this way and my other tampons not like that like why are you coming out of me why like why you not like this it's all but why you not in a circle like you feel me so yeah now i'm gonna do the same shit with this one you feel me i'll pull it out I ain't just do this right because this was gonna happen if you don't pull the joint out right. It's going when you try take this joint out, it's not gonna come out. It's gonna look just like this, and that just kind of fucked up the way I was trying to show y'all. But I'm gonna just take it out. Yeah, so I'm finna get this all soaked up so you can see this shape. All right, boom. You see how this shape is like a circle. And that other one was an oval. I don't know if that's why it was hurting, but that's why it was hurting and I was not fucking with that. Now, this core brand, like I said, they do come with their own pads. I did try their pads. I do not like their pads. So, I like the L Brands pads and Cora's tampons. I do not like Cora's pads. They just wasn't soaking up like how I'm used to. And it's just so annoying when you would try to take the shit off like it'll be so sticky trying like take the little sticky part off the back and then when you try to rip it off the pan it was just it, was, it just wasn't it wasn't them it wasn't it just wasn't them so yeah and then as far as when i on my period i just regardless i just like to use wipes like i rather use wipes when i'm going to the bathroom than toilet paper like i just feel more fresh i feel more clean Anybody who knows me to know, even if I'm not on my uh, menstrual, I'm always going to have me some backup tampons, backup pads. You never know. Just because you never know if your friends come on. Like, I was always the friend in school. They coming to me or even if it was a stranger and a girl needed some tampon or a pad. Well, I didn't carry tampons back then. I only carry pads. But they were always coming to me because I always had extra. I always kept extra just because you got to be pale, okay? But yeah, I like to use wipes especially if you are a female and you be wearing a pad please get you a little i like the huggies i use huggies i've tried that summer's eve ew it was just a no it was a no for me it was just too much smell i didn't like it it just was a no it was too little for now i like me huggies i just give me the huggies naturals you feel me they do have feminine wipes i just don't like feminine wipes i don't like feminine wipes i just don't like them they always be like oh it's no fragrance they be having a fucking fragrance i just do not like feminine wipes everything works different for different people so you feel me if that shit worked for you it worked for you but this is just my personal preference this is what i like i like wipes they just if you using a pad if you on your period Take a Ziploc bag, take a couple of the wipes out, put it in there, carry it around with you so you don't have to carry no big ass joint like this around with you. You can be discreet if you want to, when you want to back from. I just love wipes. It just make me feel fresh. Like anytime, if I'm not on my pair, I like to use wipes when I poop. I use wipes. Like I just like to feel fresh 25H. You feel me? So i like to use wipes especially on that time of the month because usually now with a tampon i like tampons because you don't you're not sending no blood you're not sending no blood like you chilling you feel me you're not sending no blood you dry 
and if you got a little slip up if it leak is not nothing too crazy but i always just keep the wipe just in case you may have a leak or something you could clean it up now if you wearing a pad i definitely suggest that you um get some wipes so that you could be more fresh and clean and just keep smelling fresh so you feel me because i don't know some people like you could tell when they're gonna pray you could just smell them like when they walk past you just smell them or when they leave out the bathroom you smell them like and i just feel like tampons because when you sit in blood it's keeping a smell so that's why when females go to the bathroom and they change their joint you could it might have like a little after smell because you sitting in blood not all the time when you wear a pad and, it's, and then it's not gonna be after smell every time but excuse me most of the time that's probably what's from especially if a girl has like a really 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 heavy flow so you know if you want i always keep like i said i always keep perfume always my travel drones i always keep perfume in my bag everywhere i go i keep the perfume on me keep some just to make sure you smell good smell fresh what else i could suggest don't try well i ain't even gonna say for me i don't like to use too much of scented soaps or anything like that just because like my body be sensitive like it's this one dove soap i think i like microfoliant little beads in there i cannot use that that shit make me itch so bad especially like i know if it's something with a soap or a fabric or something because my boobs y'all is so sensitive okay these little nipple areas will be so dry and it will itch so bad and it's just not a good joint but yeah just keep stuff and you know keep you fresh this is just what i like to use not everything is this every, no not everything i ain't gonna get into like soaps and all that because i'm not about to get into that that's just another video like a hygiene video but i just want to show y'all what i like what i use well some, some of the things i use during my menstrual these are the main things i love tampons i love wipes and i use pads at night i do not sleep in no tampon overnight i'm just not gonna do that I'm just not finna do that. Uh, I would suggest if you are maybe like a younger girl and you don't like, you feel me, pads, I would definitely suggest tampons. I know back then I was like, I think I was scared because I'm just like, especially before I lost my virginity, I'm like, I ain't about to pop this turd. Because I didn't know. Like, I just assumed like, well, this shit wants to go there. It's going to pop this. You feel me? But... I would des definitely suggest tampons. At one point in time, before I got tampons, I was looking at the menstrual cups. I was going to try those, but then I'm just like, no, I don't got time. Because that's, I feel like, more, like, you really got to be up to par with menstrual cups. Because you got to make sure they clean. You got to have the boiling water and clean. I don't got time for that. And then you got, it might get messy if you pull that shit out. I'm clumsy and all the blood might spill on me down. Be so, like, I don't got time for that. So, I just stick with my tampons. I love me my tampons because, you know, you could do anything with them joints. And I know people be like, oh, well, when I tried it, it hurt. Or you could feel it, it was uncomfortable. That's really it because you you just have it in, like, you put it in the wrong way. If you can feel it, you feel me? Just, if it's to the point where it's, like, annoying you, I would just take it out and try again with another one. And it may take you a couple tampons to get it in right but when you have a tampon and you really do not feel that joint like when you sit down you don't feel it you now i do like one time when i was first trying them out when i sat down i was feeling i'm just like oh uh-uh because -uh, i had it in wrong so if you don't feel it when you're standing up but if you might sit back down and you feel it or if you squat or something and you feel it just take it out and re just put in another one because you just put it in wrong sometimes you just ain't push it up far enough and you thought it was up far enough and it just wasn't up far enough it's definitely trial and error but i would suggest cora is i love cora like it's a very very good brand very very good like i said i'm heavy so and don't be no leaks you feel me i just love cora i love cora like i wouldn't suggest anything other than cora they're organic so you don't got any extra chemicals going up your cat and you 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 cool on your menstrual cycle like you're cool you good you dry and you can do whatever you please you can do whatever the fuck you please in a tampon i just don't like pads i just do not prefer some people just some people can't wear tampons and they have to wear pads you feel me it's a personal preference don't let nobody because i hate like 
when girls be trying to downplay other girls like ew how can you sit in blood on day that is so dirty girl at one point in time i know you ain't start off with no damn tampon i know you start off with a pad so chill all that out if you like to wear pads or if you just not ready to try a tampon go ahead and wear your pads don't let no other bitch try talk down about you because you wearing a pad that don't make you dirty or nothing bitch you doing you and you taking care of you and that's it that's the fuck all like me i personally do not like pads because i just personally don't like sitting in my blood but i'm not about to go around but like ew you wear a pad like that's so dirty because i'm not gonna do all that like and if you was a bitch that out there that do that you need to stop like you're rude and ew you is just ew like you just ill. You dirty. You're dirty. The fuck? I hate when girls do that. Like, we ain't even into all that. If she want to wear a pad, she want to wear a pad. Just like she want to wear a tampon, she can wear a tampon. If she want to wear the period, the little period panties that they got out, she could wear the period panties. If she want to wear a menstrual cup, she could wear a menstrual cup. Why is you worried about what's going up in somebody else's coochie? It ain't yours. Are you eating it? Would you want to eat it? but anyway yeah this is just some of the things i like to use like i said you can get cora on amazon you probably could get these on amazon too but i never looked it up if y'all want to try these just to try um these are at target they're pads like i said i love the l brand pads they're at target they're not that much you get a whole bunch in here they're not thick like the regular pads and they're way less detectable you don't always gotta be like can you see my pad can you see my pad yeah also with pads i don't like them long ass overnight pads i will use them i will prefer to use them like overnight but walking on i can't y'all oh i used to mm. I remember the first time i opened that joint up because i didn't know and i'm like what the fuck is this long ass thing arm lift ass pad going from my fucking neck to my back like what is this girl If you know, you know them long ass fucking pads, but I love them for overnight. Now, the other brand, if I'm out of this brand and it's like some old joints left under the uh, cabinet, I will use that old brand that I used to use to pad overnight because it's overnight. But otherwise, this is the one, honey. Cora is the real deal and L for the pads is the real deal. But thank y'all for watching this video. And don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And don't forget, we doing the cash giveaway for 500 subscribers. Y'all give me the 500 subscribers. We slowly grow every day. I really love y'all. I really support y'all. We're getting there. Yeah. Stay tuned for the next video. Mm -hmm.